never measure anything, so you need to see. Okay, so I'll make three caipirinhas and I'll use one line for each. So I, I cut the the white in the middle off. People have different styles, so mm -hmm. some people cut in slices. Cachaça has like a very subtle taste of uh, cane. Also, if you can get a hold of uh, sugar cane sugar, it tastes a tiny little bit better. This one is just not sugar cane sugar. So we actually have three of them. Now it's your turn. Then you sort of like you use you use the sugar as a, how do how do you call those things that you put in a oh, yeah like a uh, grit to get know. the oil out of the skin yeah. like the beach hot you can get basically beer and caipirinhas yeah. or or pure cachaça. Well, you know, like you can get caipirinhas anywhere. As I like said, it's just like it can be, it can be very working class, and you can go to the most upscale place, and they'll have caipirinhas for sure. Yeah. Like not having caipirinhas is the same thing as like not not having a drink. <laughs> you know, like if for a bar, you have to have a like yeah. I've never heard of a bar. It's like no, they don't have caipirinhas. 